It was a busy weekend for Wilbraham police as calls came flooding in on Sunday morning. Good Monday afternoon, everyone. Welcome to Western Mass News at 4. I'm Chris Pisano. And I'm Mary Wilson. People were reporting their cars had been broken into. Western Mass News reporter Paris Dunford joins us live now with the details. Paris. Chris, Mary, that's right. A number of cars were broken into over the weekend in Wilbraham. Police say the suspects even chattering car windows to commit their crimes. The number of car break-ins seem to be on the rise recently, with Wilbraham being the most recent town targeted. Police say on Sunday, calls came flooding in from multiple neighborhoods reporting the crime. Typically when they go into a neighborhood, they're trying, you know, hundreds of cars. They're just driving down the road, um, anything that they see. These break-ins took place at Brookside Drive, Pigeon Drive, Stonegate Circle, and Hunting Lane in Wilbraham Saturday night into Sunday morning. Police releasing this video of the criminals in action. People left um, items of value in their vehicles, and uh, they were forcefully entered with a hammer or rock um, to smash windows out. Other towns and cities have recently seen a spike of break-ins as well, but Wilbraham police say the method these criminals used is unusual. Several cars were actually forcefully entered, which is unusual. Typically, people uh, will go up, try to grab a car if it's unlocked, they'll enter. Police are now asking people to be more on guard, even in surrounding towns and neighborhoods. They don't believe this neighborhood will be targeted again, but they do believe these suspects will continue if they aren't caught. A lot of the crews that we see are coming up from um, Connecticut, from New Haven, Hartford area. Keep your windows up. Two, keep your cars locked. If you have an alarm, make sure it's, your alarm is turned on. Uh, park in well-lit areas. And Wilbraham police asked that if you have any information regarding these crimes to give them a call. They also asked that you check your home cameras to see if you may have video that will help them catch these suspects. Reporting live in studio, Paris Dunford for Western Mass News. Paris, thanks for that.